Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back again to another Clash Royale video. And for today, I do have an update idea video, something that would be really nice to be added into the game with a future update. So yesterday, late night, I was watching the Olympics like every other normal person. It was good, I enjoyed it, but it was some fucking women, judo, whatever. I'm gonna be honest, it was not that entertaining seeing women fight. Give us some basketball, give us some man judo, give us like some Usain Bolt action. You know what I'm saying? So I was kind of bored to death and I was trying to think of video ideas. So this came to my mind. Wouldn't it be fucking awesome if we had an invisibility spell in the game? So this idea was in the community back in the day with Clash of Clans. People wanted to see the invisibility spell in Clash of Clans because actually it's in one of Supercell games. The invisibility spell is in Boom Beach and it does exactly what its name is. You just throw it and the troops that are in that uh, area cannot be affected by anything. Unfortunately, that never came to Clash of Clans. But now that I'm thinking of it, they kinda implemented that with the ability of the Grand Warden. Because if you remember, if you played Clash of Clans, when you activated the Grand Warden, the troops in that area could not be affected by anything. So although it's not the invisibility spell, it's the exact same thing. So I could definitely see that spell being added to Clash Royale. We do have spells in Clash Royale that do not actually exist in Clash of Clans, like the Zap spell. And like, think of it, the invisibility spell will be so freaking good. It's the exact same concept as the Miner, which is a ground troop, and the Goblin Barrel, which is an air troop. You deploy them and they cannot be affected at all. The Miner is underground, the Goblin Barrel is in the air, they can only be destroyed when touching the ground. And in the Miner's case, coming to the surface. So I would say that the invisibility spell should cost uh, somewhere between 3 and 5 elixir, covering an area similar to the poison spell and of course have a really small duration. 2 or even 3 seconds would be dope, otherwise it would be super overpowered if it lasted for 4, 5 or even 6 seconds. Because so far with the updates we've been getting for Clash Royale, we keep getting only troops, we've never gotten a spell. I don't know how can you describe the log but that shit is not a spell. I'm talking about an actual spell, the invisibility spell, or whatever you want to call it. Like, think of it, you have a good push over there, but it is really low on health. And you want to actually get those troops, attack the opponent's tower. Boom! You throw the invisibility spell, they cannot be destroyed, the opponent's troops and towers cannot see them, they just stop shooting. Two seconds duration, boom, they touch the tower, they hit it, it goes down. Perfect. I can definitely see that coming to Clash Royale because I told you guys, it's the exact same concept as the Miner and the Goblin Barrel. As you can see, they're not overpowered at all, although you cannot destroy them until they touch the ground. So definitely, I would love to see that, maybe even as a legendary card, just to see a legendary spell coming to the game. So yeah, that's gonna be for today's video, guys. Let me know down in the comments below what do you think of this update idea and if you think it could make it into Clash Royale. So make sure you leave a like down below as well. As always, thank you very much for watching. Subscribe if you aren't subscribed to the channel already. And see ya in the next one.